Good evening to you. I'm Tiffany Murphy. And I'm Greg Kerr. Thanks for being with us tonight. Tonight, the mother of a baby girl who suffered one of the worst cases of child abuse some doctors have ever seen is going to state prison for at least 28 years. A judge sentenced Christine Johnson this afternoon on two counts of injury to a child. Investigators say in 2013, baby Faith Mason received severe brain damage and about 20 broken bones. The baby was about a month old. Doctors say two years later, Faith is still trying to recover from her injuries. KFDM's Jessica Crawford reports the prosecutor has high hopes for baby Faith's future. Baby Faith's mother, Christine Johnson, walked into court Monday, not knowing what punishment to expect. Prosecutors argued for a long sentence. A mother didn't have any sympathy for her child, so why should they have sympathy for her? Pat Canal was the lead prosecutor in the case heard in Judge John Stevens' courtroom. She was held accountable. She was found guilty. Friday, the jury of 11 men and one woman found Johnson guilty of recklessly causing injury to a child and knowingly by omission causing injury to her daughter, baby Faith Mason, in 2013. She's been sentenced to prison even though she didn't accept responsibility. She hasn't uh, ever shown any form of remorse. On the first count, the jury decided on a 20-year sentence, the maximum. On the second count, the jury decided on a 65-year sentence. She could have received life. They've held her accountable and they put her in the penitentiary uh, for, uh, you know, 65 years and, and she has to serve at least 30 of that before she gets out. Uh, that will put her past her childbearing years and so I, I feel like today Jefferson County can be uh, pleased with their uh, with their jury. We felt Christine was not the primary actor. We're disappointed with the verdict, but we respect the jury's decision. Thank you. During closing arguments, Knauth broke several pencils to recreate the sounds of bones breaking. He says now that Johnson's trial is over, the focus needs to be on faith and her future. She needs to be adopted by someone, and we hope that happens. It, she has significant needs, but she needs a real mother, a real father, a real family, and we hope that at least this can transcend to that. In Jefferson County, Jessica Crawford, KFDM 6 News. The child's father is also charged with injury to a child. No word yet on a court date for him. We posted this story to our KFDM News Facebook page when we first broke the news about the sentencing. It's racked up more than 50,000 views and dozens of comments. Here are just a few of them. One viewer writes, quote, that's still not enough time. This child is going to have problems all her life. I believe she should have gotten life in prison. Another viewer writes, quote, Justice is served for that sweet baby girl. And this last one says, quote, she deserves every bit of it and more for what she did to poor baby Faith. To view more comments or post your own, you can head to our KFDM News Facebook page.